Good afternoon guys from Boulder Road in the National Forest outside of Livingston, Montana. It's a beautiful day here. The last campsite was awesome because it was in the trees and shaded. Um, we're heading back down this road. Have no idea how far, uh, but we do know there's an old mining town up here. But the scenery gets better and better the further back we get. That's awesome. There's a lot of uh, church camps back here on this road and like seriously, beautiful, beautiful country for uh, a retreat. So as you can see, this is just a dirt road, but further back we get, the rougher it gets. We have seen some uh, travel trailers up to the point where we were staying. Uh, so that'd be a long, slow haul bringing your uh, trailer back here, but this is perfect country. So far, like a sprinter van could make it back here, and uh, we haven't even hit four-wheel drive yet. Well, what do you think? Uh, you've driven out in the streets. This is the first time on a trail. Uneventful so far. I mean, there's lots of big crevices from where waters run down, and that's uh, feels a little hairy, but this thing handles it perfectly. Like, you kind of are nervous to go over it, and then you hardly notice it, and then it's bumpy. Alright guys, if you remember uh, on day one of this trip, I, we were talking about our intentions with this vehicle and that we're not going to do anything stupid. This is a shakedown run. This is just like practice. We are not about to venture up this trail any further in our brand new to us $88,000 vehicle. Now if we were in the middle of Zimbabwe and this was, you know, in our path between two destinations obviously we would do it but we don't have to do it right now and if you look it's only going to get worse i guess this would have been a good time to have our side by side now the younger benny would have just bombed right up that mature benny no sure. uh, uh, uh. older oh what older benny wiser Older. More experienced. Older. Seasoned. Older. Well, it's 4.05 in the afternoon, so we've come to the conclusion we are not gonna make it off of this road tonight unless we decide to push it. And there's really no need to. All right, guys, tell me this is not an awesome campsite. It is right by the road, though. People have staged a nice little uh, seating area. Uh, it's almost like our steps were meant to be there in order to get leveled out ran a tire up on that rock then got the little uh, pond right over there well tonight seemed like a good night to test out our new barbecue we got it off Amazon don't have any opinions about it yet aside from the engineers that designed it really should have made those so if the screw falls off it doesn't fall into a silver hole there and we are gonna throw on some chicken breasts and tonight's seasoning of choice is the Kirkland Organic No Salt Seasoning. 
This stuff tastes really good. There's just one trick to it. Be generous and add sea salt. And the rest of that broccoli and cauliflower medley. Oops. Serious. That's the temp sensor. If I move it over, will it work? Nope. Okay, flattened it out anymore. Clearly, there is a design flaw. This is not going to serve any purpose. So we have no room for it in our lives. Are we keeping this thing? The jury's still out yet. It looks pretty though. Yeah. Especially with our little table. Okay, it took a bit to figure out that the hot side is over here, but dinner is done. Pot of rice, the uh, broccoli, cauliflower, and chicken. All right, guys, I think we're gonna call it a night. Enjoy the fire and our dinner. Thanks for riding along with us today. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, be sure to do so. And we'll see you tomorrow.